In business today, three things to know. First, stop the presses. In his last act as chairman, Ben Bernanke shaves $10 billion off the Federal Reserve's bond buying program. Snubbed, why the French feel dissed by the U.S. A slow slog uphill for the world's economy. I'm Andrew Schwartz, and welcome to Davos, where the World Economic Forum will begin tonight, and about 3,000 people expected to attend. We will have a terrific week of programming ahead for you. If 12 months from now I haven't been into space and back on a Virgin Galactic spaceship, I will eat my hat. <laughs> There are many questions surrounding $20 billion of oil money that may or may not be missing from the coffers of Nigeria's government. What I want to tell you is that the Nigerian economy is stable. I don't know those who are calling it a Saturday night massacre, but we haven't experienced any significant outflows. Richard Bobay is the well-known vice president of equity research at Rafferty Capital. How did banks get into the position of being outright vilified? They didn't create the crisis. The crisis was created because there was a massive amount of money in the Far East. Do you think his decision to come out right now will have consequences for his upcoming career? All they can do now is just focus on his skills as a football player, which is the most important thing coming up in the draft right now. What are your thoughts about the media self-censoring on this particular issue? It's unbelievable. I was like, yeah, freedom of speech, right on. Time for liquid lunch, things that make us want to drink. Could she have been separated at birth from, say, Grimace? The last important thing that came out of Davos was a new way to, to uh, display shrimp cocktail. And that was a couple of years ago. <laughs> Big move. I missed, shrimp I missed cocktail, that this yeah. year. In the corner office, the CEO of Monster Cable. Well, innovation is really hard to, uh, today because hey, we don't make TVs. We don't make the right. really big things. We make accessories. Welcome celebrity entrepreneur, best-selling author, publisher, and philanthropist, Laura Gray. Well, the first thing that we have to realize is a job, a J-O-B, was never created to make you wealthy. Golden Crust Bakery president and co-founder Lowell Hawthorne. There came a time when I decided, you know what, I want to do what I do best, which is baking. Democratic Congresswoman Yvette Clark from New York. What more do you think the federal government can do here? One thing we can do is, is really extend unemployment insurance. Bert Flickinger from the Strategic Research Group is back here on Exchange. I can't understand why uh, retailers like Target take 19 days. Uh, when, uh, well, I know, I know why. Because a whole bunch of them sit in a boardroom somewhere and say, what are we going to do? Time now for our favorite person of the day when we pick one person who grabbed our attention and not for the right reasons. Today, it is the former head of the International Monetary Fund who allegedly used his financial talents and insatiable appetite for sex after weighing all the worthy candidates. Rob Ford is our favorite person of the year. Yes. Entertaining Money Daily's exchange starts now.